Irvine Spine and Wellness Center, your Irvine chiropractor. This video has to do with adjusting the whole spine. I'm here with Carolyn, and Carolyn, why don't you tell us what you just said about your neck? So my neck in this area feels like it's hard to hold my head up, like I'm straining or I, it, I can't get in a comfortable position. I feel like my head's heavy. And it's only on the left side? More on the left side. So it's on both sides, but more on the left side, correct? Do you have anything that contributed to it or just the case of, you know, what just happens? Um, I have a history of quite a few auto accidents and trauma. Okay, and um, any specific thing that contributed to this episode of your, you being super lucky with the neck issues? Um, I don't think so. Okay, so just uh, probably being behind a computer yes. most of the day, all yes. day, mm -hmm. contributes to it. And so this is a person going in with a package with previous history of trauma of one way or another, you know, could be car accidents or who knows, sports, anything. Does that's, that's regardless of the cause or the method of trauma. So I'm gonna go ahead and adjust. Now, Carolyn has been adjusted before. I'm gonna palpate the neck before I adjust and I'm gonna just make sure adjustment is the case. Sometimes I opt not to adjust the cervical spine um, the neck uh, because mobilization is better. Studies show that in super acute cases, mobilization seems to be taken easier. And studies on, of course, not that I'm calling you a horse, but this study was actually <laughs> done on horses. <laughs> Equal adjustment. <laughs> but you get the picture. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, of course, they tried it on horses, you know. I'm not gonna go after research that's done on. Uh, fruit fly either <laughs> or rats for that matter so I know everything else is good there is no other trauma or recent incidents so there I'm gonna on Carolyn I've used other methods of adjustment there's more than one that one already <laughs> <laughs> with palpation that one was just dying to move so there are different methods of adjustment and you'll actually get to see probably an osseous adjustment in the uh, mid-back, drop piece in the lower back, and mobilization of the neck. We'll see. So just hang in there. There we go. Take a nice deep breath in it. And all the way out. All the way. Very nice. One more time. So there's tension here. I'm not going to up the force. What I'm going to do is have you bend your knees with your knees up. So that changes the curvature. This is in the area what we call transitional segment. So I'm just gonna go in there and see if that makes a difference. Bring this up a little bit closer. Take a nice deep breath in. And it did it. Did you hear that? Yeah, beautiful. <laughs> Good there. So we don't wanna up the force. That's like the worst thing we can do. We wanna work with the body. Adjustment is like a waltz. Someone leads the other one, but you can't tell. Of course, we know the rules in adjusting people, the body rules. So I, as a chiropractor, I have to pay close attention to see if I've got the permission, so to speak. And we're not fighting, we're dancing. So your, your left SI is off. All right, so I'm gonna use the, the drop piece here. <coughs> just nice and easy so in this method of adjustment instead of moving the patient and um, positioning him differently I position my what's called line of drive how I thrust and adjust the segment you okay there mm -hmm. actually that one did it now I see something else here On your back. So the point I'm trying to make is adjustment is great, but it doesn't always have to be done the same way. And it doesn't always have to be present. As long as we stimulate in the right direction, we're good. 
So mobilization, Carolyn's neck, I've seen the x-ray. I know the history. You guys don't know. So I have to be super careful with Carolyn's neck. Carolyn has to be super careful as to who adjusts her neck because the neck is very unstable. You said it, it was on the left side. It feels I like feel it. a lot oh, on yeah. the right side, actually quite a bit. So go ahead and bend your knees. So the reason we want to bend the knees is because I want to take away any tension and pulling of the muscles on the both sides of the neck. And I'm actually going to adjust right here, Carolyn. Get closer for those guys who keep saying, can you get a better <laughs> It's crazy. Nice and relaxed. Very good. So that was her C7 where the neck gets connected to the body and it was off. I really, really wanted to, that creates so much tension. And right here, I'm going to go across here and see what I feel. I feel like I have to do a combination move on this side and do a little bit of mobilization. So with mobilization, I'm going to, in this case, Carolyn, go ahead and bring your head up, chin up, and turn your head towards me gently and up again and towards me again. Right there. Hold it. Chin down. Very good. A tiny bit more. And up again. And towards me again. You okay there? Mm -hmm. Are we still friends? Mm -hmm. I'm not killing you, right? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. Let's go back to the center. And relax. So the reason I opted for that is because <coughs> she's just, she's actually very, what we call hypertonic, very spastic on the right side, too much tension on the right side of the neck, all the way from the very bottom to the very top. And like I said, I've seen Carolyn's x-ray, which at times I wish I did. <laughs> so right here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a mobilization here too. So chin up and turn towards me, Carolyn. Right there. And go back. And now again, I'm going to go here, isolate the area, and turn your head. Right there. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Hold it there and bring your chin up. Up a little bit more. Very good. And turn towards me. Very good. And go back. And up again. Very nice. Let's just go back and forth a few times. Let's just stop there for a sec. Let's reevaluate. It's still there. Less. But still tense. So... I think I just felt something there. Relax it. It's your occiput. All right, we're gonna adjust the occiput. Chin up. Chin up. One more. There we go. Very little. Let's go over here. Relax your shoulder. That was the occiput. That's where the head sits on the neck. So, a few things to pay close attention to. We cannot decide to adjust and go for it no matter what. We have to pay close attention. Does the tissue surrounding tissue relax enough? The history of the individual is important. The presentation of the neck in this case, how the curvature is super important and the, the lifestyle plays a huge role. Just because a person has tension doesn't mean they have to get adjusted. They could need to be mobilized. And the other thing that I wanna make sure you understand is adjustment's not gonna fix everything. Adjustment simply stimulates the nervous system. What comes after that is important. So you get relief from it but then what caused the tension to begin with needs to be addressed. The nutrition it takes to, to uh, heal the soft tissue is important. And also 
the things that you need to do on your own to strengthen the area is important. So in Carolyn's case, obviously the head is sitting on the neck. Why is it that one side is more tense than the other side? Why is it that she feels it on the opposite side? You said it was your left side. Mm -hmm. I saw it, what I felt was all on the right side. So there's a good chance that this has been going on, Carolyn, long mm -hmm. enough. And what you're experiencing is the left side trying to pull whatever was off to the right, mm -hmm. trying to pull it back to the center. Okay. So you are experiencing the tension or the symptoms, I should say, on the left side, whereas I, I'm, I don't know what pain she has, but I know what side's not functioning properly. Mm -hmm. So these are the things that need to be evaluated. Don't think you're gonna go to a chiropractor, they're gonna adjust your neck and you're good to go. Doesn't work that way. You gotta do things after that that matters. Anyway, here's an adjustment video with quite a bit of explanation for those requests I get for more videos of people adjusting. Thanks for watching. Take care.